The liver is a large, complex organ with numerous functions, which include metabolic and hematologic regulation and bile production. It is the largest organ of the abdomen, occupying a major portion of the right hypochondriac and epigastric regions, sometimes extending into the left hypochondriac and umbilical regions. The liver is bordered superiorly, laterally, and anteriorly by the right hemidiaphragm. The medial surface is bordered by the stomach, duodenum, and transverse colon. The inferior surface is bordered by the hepatic flexure of the colon, and the posterior surface is bordered by the right kidney. The liver is surrounded by a strong connective tissue capsule, glissens capsule, that gives shape and stability to the soft hepatic tissue. It is also entirely covered by peritoneum except for the gallbladder fossa, the surface opposed to the inferior vena cava, and the bare area, which is the liver surface between the superior and inferior coronary ligaments. The liver is attached to the diaphragm via the right and left triangular ligaments, which are extensions of the coronary ligaments. The liver can be divided into lobes according to surface anatomy or into segments according to vascular supply. The four lobes commonly used for reference based on surface anatomy are the left, right, caudate, and quadrate. The left lobe is the most anterior of the liver lobes, extending across the midline. The right lobe is the largest of the four lobes and is separated from the left lobe by the interlobar fissure. The smallest lobe is the caudate lobe, which is located on the inferior and posterior liver surface, sandwiched between the IVC and the ligamentum venosum. The ligamentum venosum is a fibrous remnant of the ductus venosum of the fetal circulation. The quadrate lobe is located on the anteroinferior surface of the left lobe between the gallbladder and the round ligament. The hilum of the liver the porta hepatis is located on the inferomedial border of the liver. It is the central location for vessels to enter and exit the liver. Within the liver, there are several main grooves or fissures that are useful in defining the lobes and boundaries of the hepatic segments. The fissure for the round ligament divides the left hepatic lobe into medial and lateral segments. The fissure for the ligamentum venosum separates the caudate lobe from the left lobe and the transverse fissure portal contains the horizontal portions of the right and left portal veins. The interlobar fissure, main lobar fissure, an imaginary line drawn through the gallbladder fossa and the middle hepatic vein to the IVC, divides the right from the left lobes of the liver. Current practice favors the division of the liver into eight segments, according to its vascular supply, which can aid in surgical resection. According to the French anatomist Couinard, 
the liver can be divided into segments based on the branching of the portal and hepatic veins. The three main hepatic veins divide the liver longitudinally into four sections. The middle hepatic vein divides the liver into right and left lobes. The right lobe is divided into anterior and posterior sections by the right hepatic vein. And the left lobe is divided into medial and lateral sections by the left hepatic vein. Each section is then subdivided transversely by the right and left portal veins, creating eight segments. Each segment can be considered functionally independent. Each has its own branch of that hepatic artery, portal vein, and bile duct, and is drained by a branch of that hepatic veins 